Okay, y'all. It is December 13. Hope everyone survived the 1212 portal. I have to say, yesterday, out in public, everyone was awesome. This morning, I went out in public, and everyone was very odd and almost disorientated at the gas station. I'm not sure what happened overnight. Um, <laughs> just curious if anyone else noticed that. Um, we're going to do a seven card pull today, Sacral Chakra. Um, as with all tarot card reads, take what resonates, leave the rest, may or may not resonate with you. Uh, there's a whole lot of energies on this planet and I am sure not trying to tap into all of them. Okay, oops, all for one and one for all here. Queen of Pentacles at the root chakra. Ah, the Magician in reverse with the Sacral. Two of Swords, Solar Plexus, Nine of Wands at the heart, Ace of Swords in the reverse at the Throat Chakra, Five of Swords in the reverse for the Third Eye, Two of Wands at the Crown. Okay. Queen of Pentacles at the Root Chakra. Um, root Chakra, safety, stability, comfort. You know, the Queen of Pentacles, she's solid. Um, Everything's in order, so maybe, you know, financially you're good. Um, this one's kind of all over the board. You'll have to decide uh, what it means for you. You know, home home is stable. The money looks okay. You know, maybe you're not starving. Uh, but at the sacral, you know, creativity, emotional intelligence, sexuality, um, the magician in reverse you know, the magician is, is a uh, manifestation. It's, um, you know, a good time to move forward with an idea and remain committed to it. I don't know. Are you guys, is someone thinking about a divorce here or what? Is this a divorce reading? Um, you know, because this says you you don't know what to do. Um, at the solar plexus, personal identity, ego, transformation, two of swords is like, I mean, I kind of read that as a, a conflict card. Um It sounds like, I don't know, or two people, it seems like an impasse. Um, you know, there's no clear resolution. Um, boy, I don't know how this oddly turned into a relationship reading because that's sure not what I intended on starting out with. Um, 
you know, the Knight of Wands, he's solid. He's the go for it card. Um, you know, that's at the heart. Love, acceptance, compassion, spirit, love. And then at the throat chakra, communication, speech, clear thought, writing. You've got the Ace of Swords in reverse. Um, you know, Ace of Swords is a new way of thinking. Ace of Swords in reverse is like you're, you're stuck in an old way of thinking. Maybe you're stuck in a rut. Maybe you want to move forward. I, I don't know. Are things blah in your life? You know, five of swords in reverse at the third eye. Third eye is intuition, awareness, you know, future thinking, duality. Five of swords in reverse. Um... Fallout, disagreement, conflict resembles the fallout from winning a battle, you know. It is in the reverse. So, I mean, the negative card, then in the reverse, would that be a positive? And then two of wands uh, for the crown. Um, the crown's thought, knowing, transformation, self-realization, enlightenment. Um... You know, I'm, you can hear me uh, flipping through to, to clarify here. I'm Again, I'm not shy about it. Um, you know, I guess, you know, this could be career. This could also be career. Because, um, Lord, I don't want to do a divorce reading. Maybe it's your job. Maybe, maybe your job is stable and you make good money. But you, you know... You're not coming up with new creative ideas. Um, you know, maybe you just got over a conflict at work. Um, you know, I don't know. Maybe your heart's not in it. Um, maybe you don't feel like you can speak freely at work with your ideas. Sorry, this was the heart, you know. Was the Knight of Wands. Um... I would definitely say someone is very conflicted. Who is conflicted, guys? And then the two the two of wands is is planning for the future. If the ace is a sign of a new beginning, the two symbolizes the first steps. So, you know, maybe you're at a stall out at work. Maybe you feel like you can't talk about it. And maybe you really need to. Maybe you feel like you're not being heard. Um, you know, maybe this is a reading for Twitter. Maybe this is what all the employees of Twitter are feeling like, right? <laughs> uh, um, I don't know. I, I'm just going to say it, guys. This is, uh, this is a conflicting one. I would say whatever you're dealing with, whether it's love, relationship, work, it sounds like you really need to, you know, having this at um, the third eye, it sounds like you're not really able to see how to move forward. And it sounds like there's a block of communication and you're really going to need to... Um, I would say sit and ponder on this one. I would definitely not make any quick reactions off this reading. Um, seek advice of your elders and not a tarot card reading. That is my advice for you. <laughs> Communicate with your boss or your coworker or your lover or whoever you're really having a problem with before you... Because this is all just like, I'm lost. You don't know what to do. It just seems like there could be an answer in sight, you know, with the two of wands. Thought knowing, you know, maybe you know what you want to do and you're afraid of voicing it and the fallout and 
you know, magician in the reverse could be that you don't see a future in it or you've lost your creativity at work. Maybe you've hit the mental wall. I would just, again, I would hate for this to be like a breakup reading, you know, in a relationship. But if it's time to go, it's time to go. So that I will say, you know, people need to learn to break up and divorce with dignity and stop trying to rob everyone. Um, <laughs> and as far as Twitter goes, man, I don't really have an opinion on that. But uh, I was just being funny, but. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the most awkward chakra reading ever. And, um, you know, I would say, <laughs> I would say if you're lost and, and you're really not able to, you know, I'm seeing conflict, conflict, magician reverse is never good. That's a swindler, you know, that's a, a robber. Maybe someone's lying to you, you know? I mean, it seems like you're stable. If you're root shocker, you got the queen of pentacles. It seems like you're solid. It seems like things around you are not solid and are confusing. So stay solid. I don't know what else to tell you. All for one and one for all. Good luck.